You can run the saved imports or exports anytime you want to repeat the operation. Open the database which has the saved specification. When you run an import specification, the current database is the destination database. When you run an export specification, the current database is the source database. If the data was exported with formatting and layout to an Excel workbook or a Word document, open the object and make sure the fields that you want to export are not hidden in the view. Similarly, review the filter settings to make sure all the records you want exported are visible in the view. Let us try to run export customers. The customers table data was exported with formatting and layout. Open the table and check the hidden fields and filters. On the external data tab, click on saved imports or saved exports to open the manage data tasks dialog box. Click on saved imports or saved exports to view the list of specifications. Click on saved exports. Select export customers. If you want to change the source file during an import operation or the destination file during an export operation, click on file name and change it. Make sure the new file you specify satisfies all the requirements essential for successfully completing the operation. Click on Run. If the destination file already exists, message box opens asking if you want to update the file. Click on S. Message box is displayed to confirm replacing file. If you want to replace the file, click on S. Click on No to export the data to a new file. Click on No. Enter a new file name and click on OK. Access displays a message that shows the status of the operation. You can see the customer's copy Excel file is created in the destination folder. Let us try to run an import operation which imported data from another access database into the contacts table. Select the specification and click on run. Notice that the object contacts is not replaced. A new object is created with the same name with the next up number added as suffix. See new table contacts one. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.